the kind of football you wanted to bring to Tottenham Hotspur? Yeah, look, it was good today for sure. Um, obviously, going a goal down again, you get tested, and you know, particularly after midweek, and and you're looking for what sort of reaction the lads have and I thought they were outstanding and just staying really calm and clear and playing our football and we grew into the game <coughs> you know once we got the grips with it I thought we were really dominant um, in just about every area and um, maybe a little bit wasteful in the first half in the front third but then second half we got really clinical and uh, yeah can't praise the players highly enough in the way that they navigated um, you know the, the challenges we had today. A lot of people outside maybe thought you might go for another nine in the window. You were quite clear that probably wasn't. Is Son's performance today exactly why you didn't think that? No, it's not exactly why, but it's it's one of the reasons. You know, you kind of, you know, I've got a picture in my head about you know, what, what I want the team to look like. And, you know, again, I, I keep saying sort of well, we're still at the beginning of it. You know, we're still building. We're still, there's still a lot to be done. And, you know, it's, it's about sort of, Putting all the pieces together, and and at the same time, not not neglecting what's right in front of you. And you know, there's some really good footballers at this club, and you know, I think they have <clears throat> the ability to play in the way that you know this team needs to set up. And you know, Sonny, whether he's playing central or wide, <coughs> you know, he's he's he, he, he's got all the sort of characteristics that oh, mate, he can play in any system. But the way we want to play is he's ideal. Johnson, hmm. what, why did you want to bring him to the club? Just another exciting young player. Um, you know, he's um, he's a real threat in the front third. He's a bit different from, to what we've already got. Like I said, he's young, he's ambitious. Um, it's no secret that that's kind of been the model for, for me. You know, not just here, I've done that wherever I've gone. I think it's just about as much the person you're bringing in as the footballer and, you know, looking at him, he... He's going to fit in really well with this group because he's, like I said, he's really ambitious. He's hungry. He, he wants to sort of take his game to another level. And like I said, the, the the technical and the physical attributes he has, I think he'll fit in really well with us. Just last one. You wanted in the window and couldn't get. I know you wanted another centre back. You said at one point. No, it's it's you know it's it's you kind of um, when you go through these things. It, you always understand that there's so many moving parts that I think really you come out of it with, you know, an ideal picture. But it doesn't mean it's not a picture that that, that can still work. You know, it's just, um, you know, we've still done a fair bit in a short space of time. I think I said yesterday. You know, we've, you know, you look at the team we've got now. We've, we've virtually changed half a starting lineup. The way we play, the way we train, totally new coaching staff, training. You know. It was never going to be one window, this this rebuild. And, um, you know, where we sit at the moment, I'm, I'm really happy with, uh, with the players we're brought in. And James Madison, I mean, he gets, gets fouled a lot. He gets a bit stick from the crowd, but he, he, he doesn't go hiding, does he? He always, always wants the ball. Is that um, kind of a real strength of his that he kind of thrives on that situation? Yeah, look, he's, he's, he's very... Um, I mean, obviously, I've only got to know him recently on as a person, but he's he's a pretty strong, resilient guy, you know, um, mentally strong. He, he, he likes, I think, not to be targeted, but he, he likes, he wants the ball, you know, he wants it in all situations. He has that quality and um, I, I thought today was a real testament to Sonny Matters and, and Romero. They all scored, but, you know, those three who, you know, are kind of thrust into leadership positions, the way they've embrace that responsibility not just with words but with actions and not just on game day on a daily basis I think you know that's as um, that's as encouraging for me as anything because um, with, you know as fantastic players they are individually they're really bought into that team ethic and and matters is one of those you know it's not just I mean he's so creative and today you showed how clinical he was in front of goal. Um, but just his preparedness to work hard for the team, I think, is, is a great example. Okay, thank you. Thank you.